Oh! And I landed oh. it. There you go. See? Back out here for another run of the Maverick Quantum Plus Flux. Now I've uh, duct taped the body with the red duct tape. I've got sponges underneath here and um, Velcro on the sides. Now this body is super thin. One advantage the Big Rock has for sure is this this body is super thin. The wing is going to break. The body is going to break. Now, this duct tape or Gorilla Tape won't save the body from cracking, but it'll hold it together if it does crack, you know, and it'll give it some cushion. So, um, I have to say these wheels and tires are way better than the Big Rock wheels and tires. And of course, I've already said the layout was better with the center diff in the middle. We just have to see if this is tough enough. So, we're going to jump it over and over and over. Nothing crazy, just jumps that normal people would do at their house. Stump. Oh yeah, I forgot. Nixon wing. So this ain't gonna break. It might rip eventually, but it won't snap. It'll just bend. I didn't like the way it looked without a wing. Plus it needs one for handling, even though this one's kind of small. I'm gonna try to save that one. Now, if that was a stock wing, it might have broke. Perfect. Like my slippers? They're outdoor. We're having an easy RC day today, guys. <laughs> to be honest, this thing's more like a Creighton 4S than a Big Rock. And I'm sure you could run this on 4S if you put the 4S speed controller in. Of course, it's not needed. Oh, almost fell. It's not needed. This thing is uh, darn fast. If anything, I'd say gear up to like a 15 or 17. That's about it. Almost nose planted it.
Body's good. Yeah, guys, um, run some foam and reinforce your body with some duct tape or some gorilla tape. And go to Alexa and Wing if you have to. Or maybe make one out of the stuff T-Bone Racing uses for their bumpers. Now that was right on the ass. Right on the butt. And that uh, bumper's good. Wing mount's good. Now this just bent, just, just bends like it's supposed to, like that, bang, bang. Yeah, I think um, it's pretty good. That was bad. I should never hit the brakes and it was too late for me to correct. <clears throat> Tried to correct. And once again, you know, this uh, this bumper just does a great job. I've got to put thicker, thicker foam. Thicker pieces of foam right here. It's a little wobbly, but it's all good. happened yesterday too. If you don't gas it off that one lip, you'll nosedive. That side, that right side. You gotta jump off it like that. I'm just learning out here. I've only lived here for a few months. <laughs> Decided to do a backflip at the last minute. Oh. Oh no, she's all bent. Oh, she pulled through. So even the Lexan will get it sometimes. There's a. Gotta be a fix for that. Maybe a Lexan that's supported with some uh, Gorilla Tape or maybe even uh, drywall tape, something to thicken up that Lexan because it did, it did bend. And that, 
it pulled through. Better foam. Abort. <laughs> that was bad. Again, that front bumper is just really good. Those are the worst. Those are kind of the brake stuff. Those tumbles like that. No. Everything's good. Wings a little worse for wear. The body's still good. Let's see if we bend any axles or anything real quick. I mean, stuff's gonna bend, stuff's gonna break. It's an RC. And this one is stuck out of the box. I didn't even adjust anything Can't really check it The wing, the wing's got it the worst. The, the body clip's all bent. You gotta use a good body clip. These ones I put on the thick body clips they haven't fallen off yet. The first ones did. The stock ones are too thin. One good one. Get in the wrong area. I'm a dummy. Oh my goodness. I recommend that. Uh, oh wow. It, oh shit. It 
stuck between there and there. Oh, the body, the body. And I lost the pin. Got a good gouge. Everything's good. I, uh, I barely touched the brakes on that one and it nosedived. All right, let's give it a couple more. Like I said, I haven't adjusted anything on this. You now I probably turn the brakes down a little bit. Punch up, brakes down. But um, it's for sure a torture test. Because we've uh, we've landed on the roof quite a bit. I think we're uh, I think we're getting on lipo guys. Let's see if she's got one more in her report. Lost nope. one of these clips. It's probably over there. I um I wedged it between concrete and wood and the body didn't even break but it bent a little right here. Bumper took a lot of hits, a lot of hits. It's fine. Uh, the concrete gave me a little scratch there and there. All oh, the arms are solid. Everything's good. Now the shafts are bent. That's good. The wing though, that's what happened. You gotta use some really good clips and some really thick. I'll fix this, I'll tape this one up and I'll fix it. But um, these bent and they dug into this and kind of messed it up. But I'll tape it up and fix it and then we'll, uh, we'll get it back out here. Yeah, these, this stuff is not thick enough for this. this. I just had it laying around. So we got to get some better mounts. Fix that, mount it better. Use some real good body clips for it. And uh, yeah, everything's good. Everything is good. These tires are really good. These wheels are really good. The body will hold up for a while as long as you, you know, tape it up. Like I said, this one went underneath that, the deck. It was wedged between concrete, and it's good. Um, let's look on the inside. Yeah, Velcro the sides too. Why not? a little bit this is a 3000 milliamp ivonic 50 c it's, it's a decent but it's kind of small yeah. I have to say No, no, I thought that might have a bend in it, but it doesn't. Good to go. Anyway, guys, this is a great rig. Everything is going to have a few flaws. This one's flaws. Now that it's got the updated parts and stuff like that, the only really flaw I see in this is the wing and the body so far. I mean, it's got killer tires, killer suspension. The chassis is tough, really tough. Really tough, really good material. I mean, this thing nose dive so many times. Lawn dart. <laughs> I'm getting used to the brakes on this, but I'm going to end up um, turning them down anyway. 
Um, we landed on the roof a bunch of times. We landed on its ass a bunch of times. Really hard, right? Right here too. Really hard. Really hard. Nothing. Nothing broke. Um, through yes, we're gonna keep running this thing. See how it goes. All right, guys. Peace.